two fouls uh, that I feel we had to make, um, and you know, right, right or wrongly, um, you know, that's helped us get a point today. And I'm sitting by this. Is it on? Yeah, it's it's on. Argo, yeah, thank you. Yeah, first, let me start by praising the players. Uh, first half, outstanding, um, really good. Deserve to be in front at the break. Um, good character to come from behind against the run of play and then equalise. Um, really strong first half. Really, really pleased with the players. Um, then a little bit of criticism to the fact we didn't keep the ball as well second half and ultimately le leads to um, you know, counter-attacks against you. We end up running back towards your own goal. No, no real problems, I'll, I'll add. You know, Bart's not made any saves. Um, but you know, so much, if we'd been so much better with the ball second half like we were first half, then we'd have created more chances. Um, but then praise again for the players. We go down to 10 men and I thought they really dug in and, and, and defended well and scrapped and... Um, um, you know, certainly got the least we deserved was a point. Is that shame for us to take, kind of take more for a team? Or, uh, take? Yeah, in a completely professional manner, John, it is. Um, two fouls uh, that I feel we had to make, um, and you know, right, right or wrongly, um, you know, that's helped us get a point today. And he pays the price for um, he pro he pays the price for other people's, you know. Um, um, Mistakes really in, in, in what they've done, um, and it costs us a shame for Wednesday night. Um, um, but the boys, they defended well with 10 men. Um, you made Yeah, well, three three games this week. Um, Tom, Tomo's sort of, you know, a little bit up and down as, as a youngster, still finding his way. Uh, been really pleased with Jason, but I, I thought today we, we, we needed the two experienced players in there, um, and and you know, the, the form's been up and down as well, but but you know they, they are a good pairing. Lenny wants to run and step forward, and I thought he was outstanding today. Um, certainly one of his best games in a Millwall shirt, and, and deserved a goal. Um, and, and Willow just gives you that balance, and, and, and playing with Fergie at left back, then then I thought it was the right balance today. Um, they had two men there, so in the second one they particularly caught quite a bit. Yeah, the second one was at Coops. Yeah, yeah, I, you know, I was worried. And at the time there's, there's contact, then there's a penalty. First one, thought nothing in it. Um, but the, the, the second one, obviously, it's a, it's a long way away from me and Danny, so I, I, I couldn't tell for sure. Um, um, and I've not spoken to the players. So if we have got away with one, then there's certainly one we, you know, we deserve to get away with because Jed has a great run, takes on Elphick in the penalty area, has a great shot, ball's going in, the keeper makes save of the day. And he made some good saves as well, but he made save of the day. And the referee gives a goal kick. The fourth official saying to the referee, he saved it, it's a, it's a corner, it's a corner. For whatever reason, the referee chose to ignore his fourth official and his linesman. Gave a goal kick, which ultimately we needed to defend better, but they scored. So if we did get away of a penalty shot, then we just certainly deserved it. Was that man Smith's goal or was it the trouble? No, Smith is goal. Yeah. yeah. And good for Matt to get another assist. Yeah, 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 really, really pleased for, for Matt to score a sheet. He's, he's, he, he should have more goals, as you know, from following us. He should have more goals than he has. Um, so I'm really pleased for him. What's wrong with um, Jason Curry? Uh, Jason McCarthy, uh, bruised toe. Um, um, you know, we're, we're, we're a real, real tough week. Some players carrying knocks a day. Um, the, the, the physios and the doctors have done great to get out there. A um, um, bit of sickness as well. So, um, you know, we're a little bit patched up today um, so that, you know that's probably why I'm really pleased um, with, with certainly with a lot of elements of the game and, and not too critical of the players when we were poor second half at times um, because you know it's been a tough week for us uh, with, with injuries and illnesses so um, you know credit to the players Sorry and John Daddy for Barson's John Daddy's been ill yeah, we've had, like I say, we've had quite a lot, and and you know, one stage we was only going to bring 15 or 16 players uh, with, with, with the young lads. So, um, you know, the, the, the lads have lads have stepped up, and some made decisions this morning. They were good, and, and you know, you know, you want that from 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 players. Um, but John really struggling. Um, we'll have to see how he goes for Wednesday. Does it sit you in good stead ahead of two games in the week? Yeah, I, I, I think so. Look, fully aware we've not won a game today that that, that we you know we quite fancied to win in. With all due respect to, to Dan and Nick and their team, um, um, you know we thought it was, it was a game that would be good for us uh, coming here. So you know, positive is that we've got a point. Um, but you know, fully aware that, that we've not won again, um, and, and you know the critics will labour that in my team. Um, however, I think reality now is really settling in that every point we gain this year, we're going to have to earn. 
and I've said that to the players we've got to run every point and then rolling through results like today means you know that's a good point we rolled out into Wednesday we've got a tough match Wednesday at Luton have had a great result today and then a huge game sold out then for Leeds United um, you know going to the international break so I, I take it as a point game today and we build on that momentum for Luton Wednesday night